What's up, y'all? Hey, we just got off the lake, man. Lake Josephine here in Sebring, Florida. Storm's coming in. Fishing wasn't all that good anyways, but uh, we got to come out here and uh, do some fishing. Caught a couple fish, no big ones. But uh, hey, man, somebody sent me a message. They had requested I do a video on how I wired the transducer cable uh, for my three-in-one, uh, Lawrence, um, back here on the back of the boat. So no frills, man. Going to keep it nice and simple. Um, there it is. That's where I have my three-in-one mounted. It's to the right of my jack plate. It's on a transom saver. Um, no holes in the boat, man. That's what you want. You don't need to be drilling holes in the back of your transom. Um, you either go this route or get, you know, a jack plate mount. Um, that's, that's the only two ways to do it. But um, that's how I have it mounted. Uh, I got the cable that just runs straight up, okay? Up and over. And then here's the neat part, okay? I got it zip tied to the fuel line over here past the bulb. And then right here in this housing, okay? That's the trick. You wanna pop those two screws out of that housing, pull this housing off. It's a little tricky. There's some tabs in there. You might need to take a screwdriver and pop those tabs off. But the deal is, once you pop that off, there's a hole in there, okay, that you can take the end of your transducer cable, stick it in that hole. You might need to lube it up, you know, get some baby oil or something, whatever you got in the house, um, and run it, your fish tape in there. There is a hole on this side. I don't know if you can see it, but uh, that's where it daylights run your fish tape through there, run it through the hole, and you'll be able to do some finagling and get that into your fish tape. Tape around your transducer connection, pull it through, run it all the way underneath here. Come back through under here, zip tie it. And then what you wanna, there's the excess cable, cable right there. What you're gonna wanna do though, is take a fish tape right through here, okay? Run it back to the back of the boat. It'll pop out right here somewhere and then tape the end of your connection, pull it back through this way. It'll pop out here and then you can run it up here and back to your units. So pretty simple, man. I don't know, bad, bad camera work, but uh, I'm right here at the lake and I just wanted to get that out um, to whoever uh, asked me that question. So I hope that helps.